right now we're just outside the school. We're yelling. We're showing people like you know, this is happening. Please give attention to this. You know, this can't continue on. The school board's not going to do anything. And if it gets the public attention, maybe something else will happen. We're trying to help people like us who are being harassed and bullied in school. Pretty much been protesting for uh, getting a teacher who was a massive supporter of the LGBTQ community back. Show me what justice looks like. This is what justice looks like. Show me what Latinx looks like. This is what Latinx looks like. Our safe spaces are under attack. Our safe spaces are under attack. What do we do? Stand up like Latinx. Our safe spaces are under attack. What do we do? And also, we're just here to have um, LGBTQ students have their rights back. don't understand how transphobic it could be and how much danger it could put certain kids in at home. They are like going over transphobic policies like how you can only call people by their names that's an IC which is a problem. If you aren't out to your parents, then it could cause you to be forced to come out or they out you because that you have to have your parents accept the fact that you're going to change your name and help have guidance talk to them. So that can be dangerous for some trans kids. We're out here to support the community and we're trying to do our best to make people aware of our situation. And a lot of peers in school, in our school, don't understand like why all of the LGBTQ plus community is out here.